The Ukrainian army conducted combat and radiation drills on May 7 on an undisclosed training ground in Donetsk region, simulating attacks on Russian positions. The assault brigade fighters said they trained with thermobaric grenades that could kill the adversary in their trenches in an instant. Other servicemen put on protection masks and pretended to be measuring radiation and chemical levels on a battlefield. As we're amid a full scale invasion, the risk of a chemical or nuclear attack by the enemy is always there. That's why we train detecting toxic substances and an increased radiation level, Ukrainian serviceman Ostap said. The head of the UN's nuclear power watchdog warned on Saturday, May 6, that the situation around the Russian-held Zaporizhia nuclear station has become potentially dangerous as Moscow-installed officials began evacuating people from nearby areas. Rafael Grossi, director general of the International Atomic Energy Agency, called for measures to ensure the safe operation of Europe's largest nuclear plant as evacuations were underway in the nearby town of Enerhodar. <laughs> Зараз в ситуації повномасштабного вторгнення є постійна загроза хімічної радіаційної атаки з боку ворога. І тому ми доводимо до автоматизму наші навики з виявлення руйних речовин і періодичного радіаційного фону. Ти бачиш, що отримали хороші сучасні прилади, які на голову нам на декілька голів вищі, ніж ті, що були, використовувалися раніше. Ja to dałoś tak, jak to